So has this ever happened to you? Ah. I really need to access my home computer, but I'm miles from home. And these computers that I've got here just don't have on them what I need. Or one of your work colleagues is having trouble with their PC and they're asking for your help. No, yeah, no, I understand what you're saying with that, but without actually being hands-on with it, I can't work out quite what you mean. Or even you run a business IT department and you need to troubleshoot a widespread issue remotely. Well, this is where virtual network computing or VNC comes in, as this allows you to not only see the information of the other machine in question, but also interact with it and navigate around it as if you were on that machine itself. And this is something that I didn't really have that much experience in up until recently. But this is the really exciting part because Real VNC, one of the pioneers of this technology with 25 years of experience, have just released a major, much anticipated Connect version 8. It's got some amazing new features and I've partnered with them to tell you all about it. If you've used Real VNC before, then you're going to love this. And if you haven't, then this might be something you never knew you needed until you try it. I mean, how cool is being able to control this machine with this one. Now I've even used this software whilst I've been away in New York this week. I had a product brief saved on my other computer in my office back in England. And I thought I was gonna have to ask my wife to turn on my computer, log in, find the file, send it across to me. And of course, there's probably more chance that pigs might fly than that happening. But with Real VNC Connect V8, all I needed was to, for her to make sure that the computer was on and then I could gain access myself find the file and jobs are good and panic averted. But let's start with one of my favorite new features and it's a simple one, but much requested from regular users, dark mode. Much easier on the eyes, especially for any evening remote access sessions. And if you're going to be using the smartphone app, this will improve battery consumption if your phone has an AMOLED or OLED display. But it's not just dark mode. They have completely overhauled the whole of the user interface, making navigation and managing remote devices even easier than ever. Previously, you had separate apps for the viewer and server, but Connect version 8 combines both into one desktop application. This makes things so much easier and so much more user-friendly, especially for IT teams that need to be as streamlined as possible. You can customize other in and outbound settings from privacy to remote printing and screen recording, security, proxy, and authentication, just to name some. Now, one potential issue with VNCs is security and a major one is having an unauthorized person swoop in to gain access to private information. But with Connect V8, it now has advanced security measures with a range of enhancements, including a new two minute expiration code, ensuring remote sessions are both secure and time bound. And there is also 256 bit encryption and duo authentication to safeguard data and user connections. You still have reliable cross platform compatibility connecting to multiple devices from Windows, Mac OS, Linux, and mobile devices. So even if you wanted to control a Windows laptop from your MacBook or vice versa, you can do that. I really like the new in session toolbar, which you can unpin and move to any point on your screen that suits you. The toolbar includes a newly design scale, file transfer features, and multi-monitor mode, which lets you match the complete screen layout of the remote device. The version eight update brings device list filtering, which allows you to filter remote devices by device name, operating system, availability, and even specific apps just making things so much easier, simplifying device management, especially if you have, again, a large IT team. I personally don't, but our team is still growing. You can also organize remote devices into folders based on things like organization, location, or department, making it far easier to manage multiple connections. And the new dual pane file manager shows both local and remote directories, allowing you to transfer files between systems more effectively. And then there's help desk. The new help desk feature is built specifically for support teams and managed service providers who need to provide remote assistance on demand. It's designed to handle both attended and unattended devices. With help desk, users can connect to remote devices using a time limited secure code, meaning IT professionals no longer need to rely on licensed devices. This makes it ideal for scenarios where quick one-time access is required, such as assisting customers or troubleshooting issues, like I mentioned at the start of the video. You can send them a nine digit key that will then allow them to go through a series of security prompts to reduce the risk of scammers, for example. Once I've done this, you will then be notified everything is ready and you will have remote access to their computer to give them assistance. Traditionally,
traditional remote access was quite clunky and time consuming, but this is fast and intuitive and secure. You can also not only control other devices remotely, but switch back to yours while the software is still running, which is really handy if, for example, you needed to check whether a colleague has the same system settings or files as you when troubleshooting issues. Now, the quickest way to give this new software a go is simply to download it from the official website and use the free trial option. And if you find it useful, then you can go and set yourself up with a subscription with differing tiers to suit different individuals and businesses. And if you don't like it, you simply don't get on with it. I'm sure you will, but if you don't, then when the free trial ends, it ends and you'll not be charged. So it's kind of win-win if you're interested in this kind of software. I will leave all the information on Real VNC Connect V8, including free trial download links in the video description below. And if you have any questions, let me know in the comments and I'll try my best to answer any queries you have. My name's Adam. You've been the best as always. I'll love you and leave you. I'll see you in the next one. Say it's me, Peace out.